Hi, this is Henrik D. I'm gonna show you today how to read the data from an API through uh, Pentaho. We're going to use a REST uh, node and uh, we're going to read it in JSON. So um, what I want to do is to, this is my API, uh, API call I have here and um, when I execute this I get data from the site, uh, a lot of data describing all the data sets available and I want to get a list over all the data sets so I need those two fields here in the table. So uh, let's start by copying this and going to Pentao and take a uh, and just put the information here about the URL uh, in here so URL that's a string um, there we go and the value is the copied one there's only one here so that's it now we have the URL in this one and um, then we are going to use the REST transformation, the REST client here, and uh, I'm gonna drag this here for input. So uh, you could also put the URL in here, uh, but I'll accept it from the field, and this is the URL, and we have application type we need to put JSON in here and the result field is a result, that's good there you go and um, now what's going to happen is that this REST client is, is reading uh, the information in the JSON format so we need to have a JSON input transformation also do it like that main output yes please and if we go in here um source is defined in field uh yeah that's right and uh that's the result and then we need to extract data from uh, the json input and um this is maybe this is the tricky part um but you can go in here um, and look up the, the input would look like something like this and um, then there's some specification here for how to extract the data and if we go over here back to the uh, API you can see we need to the root and then go into the ID and the text so that shouldn't be so difficult let's go back and see we can have the ID and we have the text and the path will be from the root and then in down to ID and the text also and we saw that it's string all the way there you go so now this should have the information uh, that we need but um, of course we'll have all the URL and the, um, the JSON information also so let's just take it's a little uh, slow computer here sorry about that uh, so let's See if we can get fields to select. Uh, we just need the ID and the oh um, yeah, like uh, do it like this. C 
so. This is it. Hopefully this will run. Let's see what's happening. Oh yeah. JSON uh, test. Comment. Okay, I did that test already. So I didn't want to waste your time. Uh, let's see. Still running. Finished. So if we go over here and preview the data, you can see this is the idea ID and the text next to it. So there's a lot of tables here. And then of course you can use the table input uh, to get the data for each table. I'm gonna show this, show you that in a later movie. Thanks for that.